There are some deleted moments from season one or moments that didn't exactly follow the script that I really wish we had seen, so I'm gonna talk about some of those in this video. First, at Renara's wedding, her uncle makes an appearance, interrupts his niece from dancing with Harwin Strong, and takes her to a different place on the dance floor. And doesn't dance. In the show, Renara eggs him on about taking her and marrying her, and Damon roughly grabs her cheek before screams are heard when Mr. Friendzone just totally overreacts. But in the script, Damon was actually supposed to gently caress her cheek, neck, and then wrap his hand around her throat and start to choke her. The script called for it to be gently, but with actual, real menace. It is also indicated in the script that after he kills his first wife, there is now a darkness to him that Renera can see at her wedding. This would have been a nice addition to foreshadow him getting handsy choky with Renera when she reveals the prophecy to Daemon. Also explains why she recovered so quickly from it. She knows his nature, he's been doing it for years. Interestingly, also at Renera and Lenor's wedding, there was a cute exchange between the the two that we didn't get to see. It wasn't super necessary, but just another one of those nice things to have. Basically, when they're all smiley at each other at the wedding feast, Lenor was going to talk about how lucky he was to find a partner like Renera because things could have turned out a lot differently if he married a woman that didn't understand his sexual preferences. This little dialogue just shows how much they had each other's back and how their relationship and great marriage started out. I kind of would have liked to see more exchanges like this. Similarly, Lena and Renera were supposed to talk and Lena was supposed to express being happy their houses were finally joining in marriage after Viserys chose Alicent over her. And then there was going to be a beach scene of Laenor talking about his sister fondly and how much Lena always idolized Rhaenyra. Just little relationship additions that would have enriched the story, but we have to keep the children that throw temper tantrums when a million things don't happen per episode happy and trim out the slower world and character building, unfortunately. Next, after Daemon takes his niece to a brothel and news gets back to Viserys, he confronts Daemon, who doesn't deny the accuracy accusations, even though nothing happened between him and Renera besides getting to second base at best. However, Daemon was going to get one more jab in after Viserys told him to go back to the Vale, and Daemon says okay. So in the script that they didn't end up having in the show, he was going to add in, I've already taken what I wanted, implying he did actually take Renera's virginity. This was going to lead to a long, hateful stare between the brothers before Viserys exits. So it was just Daemon further being an all-around asshole. Next cutout scenes, there were going to be more scenes of Harwin interacting with Renera and his children, which I'm really disappointed they got cut. Even, heck, George R. R. Martin mentioned disappointment. One of the conversations was going to happen during the royal hunt between Renera and Tim, though I do like the nod and smile. I think that was very cute too. But Harwin was going to have a lot more interactions with Jace that just didn't make it into the final cut. Moving on, after Allison goes psycho and cuts Renera due to Amon losing an eye to one of her children, Daemon was supposed to push Cole away, put immediate pressure on Renera's arm to stop the bleeding, and tell her, I'm here. Instead of following that in the script, they just had him stand next to her after a few moments. I think it would have been nice to see him doing more to care for her, but the black standing on one side and the greens on the other was also a powerful image. Just would have been nice to see Daemon being a little bit more protective, caring. Lastly, Viserys suspected his brother killed Daemon's wife, Rhea Royce. So before Viserys can offer a union between Rhaenyra and Laenor, Corlys and Rhaenys inform him that Daemon's wife has died. They explain the circumstances of her death, but Viserys quickly changes the subject after stating how she was a good woman and good wife. However, in the script notes, Viserys is actually incredibly worried that they will mention Daemon was the one that did it, and he's waiting for the word murder to be used. Thankfully, no one brings it up besides mentioning how odd it was for a very experienced rider and hunter to die how she did. I feel like Viserys' actor Patty did do a good job of conveying his feelings with his eyes and facial expressions. So I think a majority of people probably got a little bit of a hint that Viserys was thinking, oh god, he murdered her, didn't he? Interestingly, the script also confirmed that Rhea, when she fell, broke her neck, and that's why she couldn't move when Daemon approached her. Rhea's dialogue is actually a little bit different in the script as well. In the script, Daemon walks over to her and is actually surprised by what happened and stares down at her. Instead of just whimpering, she asks him if he's going to help her or just stare, and when he walks away instead, she says, fitting. 
This is the complete opposite of her knowing that Daemon wasn't going to help her. Instead, in the show, when he approaches, she's just whimpering, and then when he walks away, she says, I knew you couldn't finish, and then called him a craven. This is one of those dialogue changes I don't think was bad, even though I included it in this video. I think her taunts of, I knew you couldn't finish, hit Daemon harder due to his issues with ED directly related to his self-image issues. Her asking him if he's going to help goes against what she thought, though. Again, Daemon wanted to kill her to be free to marry his niece. She knew he wasn't going to help her. Also, I think calling him a craven was just way better than saying fitting. So those are some of the script changes from the first season. There will, of course, be more, but let me know which one I talked about that you wish would have stayed in the show. 